Olivia Isabel Rodrigo is an American singer-songwriter and actress. She gained recognition in the late 2010s with her lead roles on the Disney television programs Bizarre Vark and High School Musical, The Musical, The Series. After signing with Jeffen and Interscope Records in 2020, Rodrigo released her debut single Driver's License, which broke various records and became one of the best-selling songs of 2021, propelling her to mainstream fame. She followed it up with singles Deja Vu and Good For You, and released her debut solo studio album, Sour, which was met with critical and commercial success, winning various accolades including three Grammy Awards. A Disney and Documentary, Olivia Rodrigo, Driving Home To You, chronicling her creative process with Sour, followed in 2022. Rodrigo has achieved two Billboard Hot 100 No. 1 singles, one Billboard 200 No. 1 album, and five multi-platinum certifications by the Recording Industry Association of America. In addition to other recognitions, she has won an American Music Award, seven Billboard Music Awards and four MTV Video Music Awards. Time named her the 2021 Entertainer of the Year and Billboard named her Woman of the Year in 2022. Life and Career 2003-2019, Early Life and Acting Olivia Isabel Rodrigo was born on February 20, 2003, at Rancho Springs Medical Center in Morietta, California, to school teacher Jennifer and family therapist Chris Rodrigo. She lived and grew up in neighboring Temecula. Rodrigo is Filipino-American, her father is Filipino while her mother has German and Irish ancestry. She has stated that her paternal great-grandfather moved from the Philippines to the United States as a teenager and her family follows Filipino traditions and cuisine. Rodrigo started taking vocal lessons in kindergarten and learned to play piano soon after. She began taking acting and singing classes at age six and started acting in theater productions in elementary school. Rodrigo was playing guitar by age 12. She grew up listening to her parents' favorite alternative rock music, such as the bands No Doubt, Pearl Jam, The White Stripes, and Green Day. Rodrigo became interested in songwriter after listening to country music, especially American singer-songwriter Taylor Swift. She moved to Los Angeles after landing her role on Bizarre Vark. Rodrigo first appeared on screen in an Old Navy commercial. Shortly after in 2015, at age 12, she made her acting debut portraying the lead role of Grace Thomas in direct-to-video film An American Girl, Grace stirs up success. In 2016, Rodrigo received recognition for starring as Paige Olvera, a guitarist in the Disney Channel series Bizarre Vark, a role she played for three seasons. In February 2019, she was cast in the starring role of Nini Salazar Roberts on the Disney and series High School Musical, The Musical, The Series, which premiered in November of that year. For the show's soundtrack, Rodrigo wrote All I Want and CO wrote Just for a Moment with CO star Joshua Bassett. Rodrigo was praised for her performance, with Joel Keller from Decider describing her as especially magnetic. In 2022, she left the show at the end of its third season to focus on her music career. 2020 present, music breakthrough and I sour slash I. None. Artistry. Influences. Rodrigo cites Taylor Swift and Lord as her idols and main musical inspirations, and also dubbed herself Swift's biggest fan in the whole world. She has also expressed admiration for the White Stripes band member Jack White, calling him her hero of all heroes. Her other influences include Alanis Morissette, Casey Musgraves, Fiona Apple, St. Vincent, Cardi B, Gwen Stefani, and Avril Lavigne. Songwriter and voice Media outlets generally describe Rodrigo as a pop artist, musically rendering to pop rock, teen pop, and indie pop styles. Rodrigo has stated that she wants to be a songwriter and not the biggest pop star that ever lived.
she revealed that she chose to sign with Interscope slash Jeffen Records because its CEO praised her songwriter, not her potential star quality. Music journalist Laura Snapes called Rodrigo a flag bearer for a new wave of songwriters who incline towards power ballads that are as emotional as ever, but project that emotion inward, trading bombast for hush, and described her musical style as rooted in heartache, mental health, and sadness, without being melodramatic, expressing more realistic perspectives than resilient. Rodrigo's voice type is identified as soprano. Other activities In April 2022, Rodrigo became consumer beauty brand Glossier's first ever celebrity partner. She is also an institute speaker and panelist for the Gina Davis Institute on Gender in Media. Politics and Activism On July 13, 2021, Rodrigo was involved in a White House effort to promote COVID-19 vaccinations among young people in the U.S. She met with President Joe Biden, Vice President Kamala Harris and Chief Medical Advisor Anthony Fossey, to discuss her efforts. CNN reported that Rodrigo would record videos about the importance of young people getting vaccinated, including answering questions the youth have regarding the vaccination. In response to the 2022 overruling of the Roe v. Wade U.S. Supreme Court ruling, Rodrigo performed Fuck You with British singer Lily Allen at Glastonbury Festival. She prefaced the performance by dedicating it to the associate justices who voted to overturn Roe, Samuel Alito, Clarence Thomas, Neil Gorsuch, Amy Coney Barrett, Brett Kavanaugh, saying I'm devastated and terrified. So many women and so many girls are going to die because of this. I wanted to dedicate this next song to the five members of the Supreme Court who have showed us that at the end of the day, they truly don't give a shit about freedom. The song is for the justices. Filmography Discography Sour Tours Sour Tour Achievements For her work in music, Rodrigo has various accolades, including three Grammy Awards, seven Billboard Music Awards, four MTV Video Music Awards, four iHeartRadio Music Awards and two People's Choice Awards, an American Music Award, a Brit Award and a Juno Award. Rodrigo was placed on the 2021 edition of Time Magazine's 100 Next List, and was named Time's Entertainer of the Year for 2021. Billboard also honored her with their Woman of the Year at the 2022 Billboard Women in Music event. She has also received Songwriter of the Year honors by Variety in 2021, and at the 2022 ASCAP Awards.